Malo and welcome to episode 73 of Breakfast Bites by TakeOverSports.com. A wrap of Pacifica People's Sports on this sunny Sunday morning, 10th September 2022. Coming to you from paradise on the 180th meridian in the middle of the Pacific Ocean. Go Papa, go Papa Rowney! Thanks Tulia. In rugby, what a relief. The stadium at the Rugby World Cup 7s in Cape Town on day 2 was... Uh, Half decent. And in the Rugby World Cup Sevens Championships quarterfinals today, the women, Australia beat England 35 5. In the men, New Zealand 12 beat Argentina 5. And New Zealand women, the Black Ferns, defeated Ireland 28 0. Then via France, men went down fighting to Australia 14 5. And uh, France women put Fijiana out of the running of the uh, championship uh, competition 1914. Fiji men disposed of uh, battling Samoa 21-10 and then um, we had USA women beating Canada 10-7 before the upset of the evening. Host South Africa men going down 24-14 to Ireland. So the uh, Rugby World Cup Sevens Championship semi-finals starting at 10.07 p.m. on Monday sees Fiji against Australia and New Zealand up against Ireland in the men's competition and in the women's comp Australia take on New Zealand and France go up against USA. In the bowls quarterfinals earlier in the tournament Tonga beat the Jamaican reggae band 17-0, but lost their bowl semi-final against Germany uh, a little later in the day or yesterday, 17-12. So uh, Tonga, not bad, out of the bowl semi-final. <clears throat> in Rugby League, the Canberra Raiders continued their stunning run at AMI, Double AMI Park, upsetting the Melbourne Storm 28-20 last night to storm into the second week of the NRL Finals. With the win, the Raiders become the first team to win five straight games against the Storm in Melbourne. They certainly have got their number. And the Cowboys block-busting uh, Tongan juggernaut Jason Taumalolo scored in the 80th minute, plus the conversion to level it 30 all with the Sharks. And this was in Sydney too, at uh, the a, a home ground for the Sharks. Neither team scored in extra time, so they headed into Golden Point, where a 40-metre field goal from the Iceman, Valentine Holmes, sealed the win for the Cowboys 32-30. In football, the English Premier League Championship and all the leagues have all been postponed, as well as the start of the new Women's Super League season due to the passing of Queen Elizabeth II, with the country now in a state of national mourning. The funeral is on Monday, 19th September, 2022, and uh, just uh, hours ago been declared a public holiday. In boxing, in a crazy 48 hours, the original UFC 279 main event in Las Vegas was scrapped after Kamsat Chimev weighed in over the welterweight limit, and the new UFC 279 main card uh, uh, pit uh, Nate Diaz, who came in on the weight, on the limit, versus Tony Ferguson. And we're now going to have uh, Chimai versus Kevin Holland. And Li Jinglian versus Daniel Rodriguez. In tennis, the U.S. Open tennis men's number three seed, Carlos Alcatraz, plays in a one-of-a-kind U.S. Open final on Sunday against number five seed, Casper Ruud from Germany. This is the first ever Grand Slam final between two players eyeing both a first major championship and the ATP's number one world tennis ranking if they win. For TeVovoSports.com, I'm Kaldan Kamir. Mahalo, Vina, and thank you. Please hit the subscribe button below if you'd like to receive more Pacifica Sports highlights on Breakfast Bites. And thank you all, Tumas, for all your love and support. Bye, Papa, bye, Papa, Ronnie. Thank you, girls.